A village pub in Suffolk, which has been shut for two years, is about to reopen after it was bought by the community. Campaigners have just got the keys for the Duke of Marlborough at Somersham near Ipswich after raising more than £300,000. The Duke himself is looking faded, the building which bears his name forlorn. But all that's about to change, a new chapter, a new lease of life is looming. It's still got the old menu boards up as well. It's been a long journey for the campaigners since the doors shut here on Christmas Eve in 2014. We joined them in the autumn of 2015 for the launch of their sale of shares. More than 230 people have since invested, most local, others from further afield, and more are still coming on board, all keen to be part of something special, something vital to this community. It was fantastic just to get the keys and open the door and just walk inside and just see the place. Um, all our dreams have been achieved. I'm one of these optimistic people, and uh, so I knew it would happen in the end. Some people didn't think it would happen, and uh, we proved them wrong. Right, fair bit of work required here, I think. It will be really, really challenging, but I think the trick lies in making sure that we have uh, more than just a pub offer. It has to do things like offer Wi-Fi, make people comfortable here during the daytime so they can come and work and have a cup of coffee. Um, you know, it has to be a hub of a community that has things going on here during the daytime. I mean, there's a lot going for it, but it still has to have that special something about the food, drink and welcome to make people want to come back again. Somersham once had three pubs. This was the last one standing and should reopen with a soft launch in the next couple of months. Volunteers at the helm to start, steadily drawing in professional expertise. The Duke hopefully standing profitable and proud once more. Kevin Birch, BBC Look East at Somersham.